So area of rectangle is length into breadth. So this you have to multiply. Both things you have to multiply. Very simple question. So you can see here now how to multiply this. So I will multiply length is my length was 66 upon 7 meters into 56 upon 55 meters. So see very simple question they have asked us. 7 1 the 7 8 the 11 6 the 11 5 the. Okay. So 8 6 the 48 upon 5. You can write this in mixed form. So see how to write. 5 9 the 45. 3 upon 5 meters square okay so area is measured in meter square so you have to write your meter square okay so this much carpet will be required let us solve the next question questions are easy and you are able to understand so if you are able to understand tell me okay so see fifth question is a roll of ribbon was cut into 26 pieces so let us write the given thing first. Roll of ribbon was cut into 26 pieces. Okay, 26 pieces of length. Okay, length of that each piece. Length of each piece is given here. See, each piece was. 2 into 3 upon 4 meters. So what was the length of the original ribbon? Length of ribbon we have to find. Length of ribbon. So that ribbon was cut into 26 pieces. Correct. And each piece was of this much length. So let us find the rational number. 4 plus 8 plus 3. 11 upon 4 meters. Okay. So 11 upon 4 meters. And 26 pieces. So means you have to multiply these two things. So, 26 pieces should be multiplied by length of each piece. So, you will get the whole ribbon's length. 2 to the 2, 13 the. So, see here, 11 3 the 33. 11 1 the 11 plus 3. 143 upon 2 meters. If you want this in mixed fraction, you can get it. So, see how to divide this. 2 7 the 2 1s are 2, 1. So here you will write 71, 1 upon 2 meters was the length of original ribbon. Okay, so see how much simple question it is. Let us do next sum. You will not waste the time. Sixth question. Find the area of square paper of side 25 upon 2 centimeters. So side is given, side of square 25 upon 2 centimeters. Okay, very easy. So, area of square, what is formula of area of square? We have to find area of square. Side into side. Correct. This is formula. So, you have to multiply 25.2 again with 25.2. 25 square is 625. And this 2 to the 4. So, this much meter square paper you will require. Let's move ahead. Seventh. Train is moving at average speed of speed of train. Speed of train is 425 upon 4 kilometer per hour. How much distance will it cover in 16 upon 5 hours? Means time they have given us. Time is equal to 16 upon 5 HRS. So what they have asked us? How much distance? Distance they have asked us. So distance we have to find. So see, here you have to use this formula. Distance is equal to speed into time. This is the formula of distance. Remember this. Okay. So, just write here, distance is equal to, so properly how to write, distance, speed, 425 upon 4 into time, 16 upon 5, 5 1 is a 5, 5 is a 40, 
फाइव फाइव जा ट्वेंटी फाइव फोर वन जा फोर फोर जा सिक्सटीन सो मल्टीप्लाई दिस बोर्ड फोर फाइव जा ट्वेंटी थर्टी टू प्लस टू थर्टी फोर थ्री हंड्रेड एंड फोर्टी किलोमीटर्स इज डिस्टेंस नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन वी विल सॉल्व एट सी वेरी सिंपल सम्स इज आर बट यू हैव टू अंडरस्टैंड द क्वेश्चन फर्स्ट ओके सो एट वन वी विल सॉल्व इन अ स्कूल फाइव अपॉन एट ऑफ द टोटल स्टूडेंट्स आर गर्ल्स If the number of girls is one twenty more than that of the boys, what is the strength of the school? How many boys are there? So they have uh, given us the question. So let us start solving the question. So first, what we will do? We will consider total number of students as x. Let the total Total number of students be x. Okay, let the total number of students be x. So now, in a school, five point eight of total students are girls. So number of girls are how much? See, number of girls are. You can see here, they are given as question. Five point eight of total students. So five point eight. Of total students, what we have taken x, so five point eight of x means five point eight of means multiplication, and x means total students. So five into x is five x upon eight girls are present in that school. Now one condition they have given: if the number of girls is more one twenty more than that of the boys, what is the strength of the school? and how many boys are there in that school so how to find this c 